launching the political campaign to support Judge Hlope. This organization claims that any move to suspend him does not serve the interest of justice. Instead, it undermines all the pending legal processes that Hlope is going through. No allegation is made that the continued service by the judge president pending the decision is, bring, is bringing the judicial, the judicial uh, uh, court and the profession into disrepute and or it impacts negatively on the working of the division of the Western Cape that he's heading. Moreover, neither the Judicial Service Commission nor Freedom Under Law has alleged that the gross misconduct allegation leveled against Judge President Lope have in the past 12 years made a direct negative impact on the workings and performance of the, of the division of the Western Cape where is ahead of that division. Meanwhile, lawyers representing Project 27, which stands for the years that Lope has been a judge, say his suspension will set a dangerous precedent. Project 27 says Lope must be allowed to continue with his appeal while he is at his office. It brings the justice system into disrepute because here we have a man who is a judge, who is a litigant before the courts, who is taking a matter to the Supreme Court of Appeal, yet in the wake of that he is suspended based on, 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 on allegations, as my colleague has, has, has asserted to, uh, uh, was actually um, held to be um, a complaint that was never uh, 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 brought before the courts. Uh, or, or, or a complaint that was dismissed. When you are a black legal professional, besides the stress of being a legal professional or a practitioner, sometimes you face the stress of the fact of your colonial history. And this is what this case is about. But as lawyers, I'm not a politician, as a lawyer, I'm saying, allow the judge to litigate his appeal to its final end. Do not suspend him. The organization will take its campaign to the streets tomorrow with a march to parliament that will include handing over a petition against the suspension of Lope. Lula Mamaya, SABC News, Cape Town.